Hello guys, this is the Swatter guy here. Welcome back to another video. Well, this time I'm gonna talk about how to get uh, level 70 less than two hours. Now, this one is gonna be really difficult compared to last year or the previous time, 65, because in that time, all you needed to do is go into uh, Dread Fortress or some of the places and uh, l you easily leveled up to 65 less than 40 minutes or something this time it's gonna be really a bit different because the level cap to 65 to 70 it's more like 5 million XP so more than 5 million XP it's like a ridiculous amount of XP XP and maybe like 6 million or something like that but it's uh, it's really close to 6 million anyway the thing is uh, it's really slow to level up uh, to 70 because the story uh, only gives you 1 million credits at the end you've done a chapter. So of course the story is obviously the main thing how you can level up fast but uh, there is also other ways what, uh, what I suggest. So since there is a lot of people still doing level 65 pvp and since the pvp uh, levels are changed because the 70 is the highest one now there's a lot of more opportunities to play pvp again so uh, my suggest is to do a few pvp matches uh, and after that do until uh, do pvp until like 66 or 66 and a half xp and after that, you can enter to one of the easy operations, so uh, Eternity Vault or Karagas Palace, and just kill all the ads in there, and you will easily get a level 70. Or you can do the different thing, which is, I think, much more uh, easily. Uh, it's like one and a half hours or something like that, which is do Eternity Vault and Karagas Palace. Uh, the reason why I'm saying uh, is that is the really reasonable thing, uh, because... Eternity Vault is giving you overall two and a half levels so maybe like three if you're killing like all of the ads and also while you're in there you will getting schematics you will get command experience points which you can use uh, as soon as you hit level 70 and stuff like that so uh, after the, after you've done that uh, you can go to Kuragas Palace and do the same also you're getting decorations schematics at the end of the last boss you will getting a gear as well so then it's pretty decent uh, in terms of like uh, also leveling and receiving stuff. And you don't need much gear for uh, Eternity Vault and Gragas Palace storyline. This is just uh, just some basic stuff you need to do in there. If you have like a decent gear, uh, you can just enter and probably if you're entering an 8-man, probably like six, six of them have like really boosted gear. So uh, if you like missing any... Of like DPS and stuff like that, you don't need to worry about that uh, because uh, the other six or five people is gonna boost that DPS up. So basically, that's that. So it's a really simple way to just level up. It's less than two hours because uh, if you compare it to storyline, it's taking like uh, six and a half hours at least to get uh, get up level seventy. So if you want to get uh, like uh, level 70 really fast, I suggest you do at least two operations, so the two easy ones, and you will easily getting into level 70. And uh, maybe at the end of, uh, depend what you've done, EV or KP, you will start getting command experience points as well, which is really good. And also you're getting crates and stuff like that, which is also really good. So that's it for this video. Hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, smash the thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time.